15 Bible Verses for Encouragement and Strength John 16 verse 33 These things I have spoken to you, that in me you may have peace. In the world you will have tribulation, but be of good cheer, I have overcome the world. Isaiah 41 verse 10 Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Philippians 4 verse 6 and 7. Verse 6. Be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Verse 7. And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Psalms 34 verses 4 and 5 and 8. Verse 4. I sought the Lord, and He heard me. And delivered me from all my fears. Verse 5. They looked to Him and were radiant. And their faces were not ashamed. Verse 8. Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who trusts in Him. Romans 8 verse 28. And we know that all things work together for good to those who love God, to those who are the called according to His purpose. Joshua 1 verse 9. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and of good courage, do not be afraid, nor be dismayed, for the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. Matthew 6 verse 31 to 34. Verse 31. Therefore do not worry, saying, What shall we eat, or, What shall we drink, or, What shall we wear? Verse 32. For after all these things the Gentiles seek. For your heavenly Father knows that you need all these things. Verse 33. But seek first the kingdom of God and His righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. Verse 34. Therefore do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about its own things. Sufficient for the day is its own trouble. Proverbs 3 verse 5 to 6. Verse 5. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. And lean not on your own understanding. Verse 6. In all your ways acknowledge Him. And He shall direct your paths. Romans 15 verse 13. Now may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing, that you may abound in hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. 2 Chronicles 7 verse 14. If my people who are called by my name will humble themselves, and pray and seek my face, and turn from their wicked ways, then I will hear from heaven, and will forgive their sin and heal their land. Philippians 2 verse 3 to 4. Verse 3. Let nothing be done through selfish ambition or conceit, but in lowliness of mind let each esteem others better than himself. Verse 4. Let each of you look out not only for his own interests, but also for the interests of others. Isaiah 41 verse 13. For I, the Lord your God, will hold your right hand. Saying to you, Fear not, I will help you. 1 Peter 5 verse 6 to 7. Verse 6. Therefore humble yourselves under the mighty hand of God, that He may exalt you in due time. Verse 7. Casting all your care upon Him, for He cares for you. Psalms 94 verse 18 to 19. Verse 18. If I say, My foot slips. Your mercy, O Lord, will hold me up. Verse 19. In the multitude of my anxieties within me. Your comforts delight my soul. Revelation 21 verse 4. And God will wipe away every tear from their eyes, there shall be no more death, nor sorrow, nor crying. There shall be no more pain, for the former things have passed away.